And so now I'm going to give some formal definitions to these ideas that I keep talking about, uh, the overlap of sets, things like that. Um, and so the first one is the overlap. Uh, it's called the intersection. The intersection of two sets is the set of elements in both sets. Okay, the set of all the elements that are in both. Uh, formally, or using set builder notation, we would say that X, uh, it's a set of all X's such that X is in A and X is in B. X is an element of A and X is an element of B. Um, the notation that we use is an upside down U shape. It kind of looks like the subset symbol turned on a 90 degree. Okay. Uh, so A intersect B. That's all the points or all the elements, keep saying points, all the elements that are contained in both sets. Right, in our example here with D, E, and T, um, I could find the intersection of E and T. So E intersect T would be all elements that are in both E and in T. And so in this case, it would be the number zero, if that's in both, and the number six, because that's in both. And there are no other elements because there are no other elements in both. Okay? So the intersection is all of the elements in both sets. We could also look at the intersection of E with D. And of course, the order I write these does not matter. I could intersect T with E and I get the same set. Um, e intersected with D. If I look at this set and this set, what elements are in both? Well, 0 is in both, 2 is in both. 4 is in both, 6 and 8. All of the elements in E are in both. And so if I wrote that out, the intersection is, of course, 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8, which in our case is equivalent to the smaller set E. In fact, any time one set is a subset of the other, then their intersection will be the smaller set, okay, the subset. Um, and for that reason, if I were to intersect T with D, the triples with the digits, uh, you're going to get out the smaller set because T in this case is a subset of D. Right? Because T is a subset of D, their intersection will be that subset. Okay, so that's the idea of intersection, just on a real basic level. Um, there are some kind of interesting intersections that are out there. Um, the intersection of any set with itself is itself. Kind of weird. Maybe that's redundant, but I'll throw it on there. Um, if you intersect a set oops, with the empty set, Uh, you will get the empty set because there are no points in common. Okay. So just a couple nuanced things that, that show up. All right, so that's the idea of intersections.